we are going to connect two machines and we will see how they are going to share files with each other okay we are going with the first practical so like my two computers will be connecting with a cable and i'm going to assign ip address here so i'm going to explain you one thing that is ip address classes we have three classes class a b c when any ip address start from 1 or between 1 to 126 you just you need to match the first part that is first is network part i'll explain so if two computers are connected together they have ip 1.1.1.1 and this computer is having 1.1.1.5 so in class a any ip address start from between 1 to 126 we just need to check the first part they are matching or not yes so it means they will communicate with each other what if i am going to give 1.1.1.1 and here 2.1.1.1 first part is matching no right so they will not communicate so in b when the ip address is between 128 to 191 so we need to match two parts guys two parts only it means when we have ip 150.1.1.1 and here we have 150.2.1.7 so just check first two parts are matching no my network bits are not matching it means they are not in my network this is the power of network bits in class c we have 192 to 223 so that is three network part so suppose i got 192 to 168 1.1 192 to 168 1.5 this is class c where we are going to match three network bits they are going to communicate yes so this 127 that is for loop back testing all your computers when windows starts right it appears a logo all the services are in background all icons of the files so that is a self hosted ip address that means these are your internal ips which are not accessible or accessible from outside we can't transfer 